My name is uh, Corporal Lopez um, with 172S4. I'm an 0431 Embarkation Specialist. So uh, my role for the ACM drill is to, it's mobility and logistics, so prepare uh, all the gear uh, and create load plans uh, for C-130s, uh, C-17s. For this drill specifically, we're doing C-17 uh, loadouts and my, my job initially is to prepare the cargo, create documents, uh, make sure it's hazmat certified and create the load plan. So the section uh, that I work with, S4, we prepared in advance by just doing this on a daily basis, uh, doing the McCree, uh, FCLP, uh, big, op, uh, big ops that we do uh, on a day-to-day -day basis, just uh, you know, doing the same thing over and over again, uh, making sure that we, we know what we're doing and obviously doing it safely. So that prepared us for, for the ACM. So it's important to do these drills because uh, it keeps us on, on our toes, keeps us prepared. Um, so that when we actually get activated, uh, there's no hiccups, no bumps, make sure the, uh, that all the sections are, are prepared and, and ready uh, on a moment's notice. So it's important to uh, you know, work outside the unit with other units like hand in hand because uh, it's a different set of eyes. So you know, we, we all have different ways of doing things. I mean, obviously we all do it the right way, but when you have a, se a second pair of eyes, it, it definitely helps uh, on a perspective. Like if we're trying to uh, get a center of balance of a vehicle and someone knows how to do it a certain way, but someone has to, knows how to do it faster and more effectively than, than hey, we're gonna, we're gonna do it that way, you know? It, that way it doesn't impede the mission. Hi, I'm Staff Sergeant Conrad for my uh, MWSS 172. I'm actually an 0481 loaded sports specialist. I'm building in the logistics chief billet right now. So the ACM drill is actually in preparation of it in case something does happen. But besides that, uh, we have a short-term notice, in which case we need to go through the entire planning process and actually have everything logistically ready to be moved, allowing us to actually be uh, more trained on what we need to get done, along with us having a better understanding of how long it should take for us to actually be able to get stuff done and shipped out to uh, K5 Wright and ready to be embarked and flown out. So the SCM drill consists of a multi-phase approach where we will have a first echelon that will go out, which will be everything they need for three days, followed by a second echelon, which will be uh, for further support, which can be up for a couple weeks to a month, and then further on with each echelon. So our role in the drill is technically we are a uh, support squadron. So we will be going out there mainly to support with fueling operations and uh, food operations. We will have everything transported out there so that we can actually support those well, two main efforts along with anything other logistic needs or support needs that the wing needs. The reason why it needs to be a short notice drill is so that we have to work within limitations and be ready to move along see if we have any stuff actually pre-planned ready to go.